What's up, everybody? Fravis here with another episode of Magic Duels Battle for Zendikar. Wow, that's the intro that I was looking for a couple, like, yesterday. <laughs> Man, that was perfect. That was, that was great, eh? I should get myself a pat on the back for that one. That was a good intro, guys. Went perfectly. Ooh, a new avatar. This guy went for the uh, Magma Man. Magma background. Very fitting. I wonder if I'm up against a red deck. I don't have to be. I probably am, though. Not that I mind. Ooh, Obi Boy. This guy, I like this guy. I like his avatar, I like his name. This guy's winning my heart right now. Ew. Ew. Ah, this is like the same hand. What the hell? <laughs> this is awful. This is like the, this is like worse than last time. My god. Okay, well, at least I go first. <laughs> at least I got a Titan Strength, too. And a uh, fiery impulse. So I, if he has a one drop, I can fiery impulse and I can tighten strength it. So everything working out okay. Actually, um, you know what? You know what? I know what this guy's up to. Oh no! Then I could just call the full moon instead. No, I gotta get rid of that thing. I gotta get rid of that thing. I know what this guy's up to. If I swing in, he's not gonna block because he's a red deck wins. Yep. He's not blocking. And now I have a fiery impulse open. Um, okay, yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that. Actually, I shouldn't have taken that. I need a creature. But uh, next turn, what he's going to do is he's going to swing in and hopefully have either a brute strength or an aura of some kind. That'll do it. <laughs> There's the aura. Pop that thing. Destroy his turn. Get the tempo. Get board control. Let me show you how it's done, son. Let me show you how it's done, son. <laughs> oh, boy. Now I got you where I want you. <laughs> oh, no. You're a 10. What happened? Uh, the only thing he has right now is uh, that exquisite firecraft card. That can, that can take care of my guy. And odds are, I don't care. Because even if he has a creature to stop this, I've... Oh no, I just played two cards. Shit. Shit. No. Oh, did I just cost myself the game? I hope not. I didn't have to do that. Oh, that's so awful. That is so awful. God, that's upsetting. I'm, I'm going to cry now. Okay, fine, whatever. Uh, let's do the same thing. Let's do the same thing as before. I don't know if he'll block. I don't think he will. He doesn't. Oh, man. What a dumb move. I, sh I should have a 4-5 out right now. Or is it 4-5? Or 4-3, sorry. 4-3 out right now. Whatever. Whatever. I got f I went first, and that's what going first does. It, it makes you fucking win. Ooh. Ho-ho. Ho oh, ho, I see. You scared of that happening again. But what choice do you have? What choice do you have? That's a better choice. That is a better choice, dude. Go with the weaker ones. I agree. <laughs> this guy did it right. This guy knows what's up. I like this guy. <laughs> Unfortunately, he is watching damage effects, which is kind of sad. Uh, swinging ding dingin. A part of me wants to put down this Goblin Glory Chaser anyway. Fuck it, I will. Fuck the world. Fuck the world. I know it's risky. I'm, I'm really putting it all out there. I probably should not be doing that. But, I don't care. I don't care. Man, he's got a lot of creatures. That He, he, had, a, he had a good hand. He had a real good hand. Hmm. Let's see if he blocks my glory chaser. I'm not sure. Do you think I do you think I top decked a, a removal? Ooh, he didn't think so. That's risky. That's risky. What do you think, man? Nah, you'd be right. Okay. <laughs> he took a risk and I think it paid off. I think it paid off for him. 
but uh, he's still in a lot of trouble. Uh, he's dead to a lot. I have a, a lot of things that'll come down and really hurt him. All right, so call the full moon, I guess, is the play here. I don't know. What's he going to do? He can't be aggressive anymore. I mean, it's not like he can swing in. I still think it would be call the full moon, unless he has some kind of twin bolt or, or removal. Because he's got to clean my board up. Because he can't, he can't even pretend to start getting aggressive until he cleans up my board. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Well, obviously you don't swing, because you just die. Uh, well, he wouldn't die, but I, I still wouldn't swing. Ooh, I would. Uh, that's a little premature. I would have done that on my turn. I would have held off on that, man. Oh, and you're swinging too? Oh, dude. That's not... Nah, no, 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 no. I wouldn't do that. What are you going to do? Three damage to me when I'm at 20? You're at five, dude. I've got three damage on the board. If I get a land, you're dead. And there it is. That's why you don't do that. Nah, man. He cost himself the game. Uh, I hope he has some kind of uh, fiery impulse or something here. Because he just lost the game for himself. He should not have swung in. Oh, wait. No. That thing has to swing in. I'm sorry. Uh, it's not your fault, man. You didn't have a choice. Didn't have a choice. Shit. Oh, well. No creatures, no removal. Damn. I'm sorry, buddy. Silly me. Well, that was a good game. That was a real good game. Uh, unfortunately, I, I knew exactly what he was doing, and the he, he just he couldn't really do anything about it. Plus, I went first. If he had gone first, this would have been a totally different game. And I even made a misplay. That, yeah, that he could have he could have done that. Uh, but I forgot that uh, the Majoring Bully has to attack. So he couldn't have hold it, held it back anyway. So the Inferno Fist play... I don't know, I still wouldn't have done it. I still would have done it on uh, my turn, rather than his turn. But, eh, that's just me. I mean, I guess it wouldn't have made a difference. If he didn't have another creature or anything, it wouldn't have made a difference. This is an interesting hand. I, I go first, but it's late. Ugh. Uh, I'm actually going to send this back. Alright, I, I like that a lot better, actually. Oh, boy. And two Molten Vortexes? Ugh, God. There's a dead card. That sucks. But I still like this hand better than the, the other one. Um, I mean, I'm going... Man, what is with red today? Everybody's been playing red. Is that like a community quest or something? I have not been paying attention to those community quests. Uh, let's get that menace going. That renown is a, a super, super great thing to have. And then it's going to be Majoring Bully again. He's watching damage effects too. Jesus, everybody loves that thing, huh? Should I just go and turn on damage effects just because I love wasting time? <laughs> By the way, this is I, I have I have not missed the uh, double Chris Pratt head to head we're we're having right now. I hope you guys like Chris Pratt because we are pratting it up today. Fiery impulse on my menacer. Actually, my um, my bully will be doing more damage to him, so that might have been a better a better target. Ooh, that's not good for you. That's not good for you because. Now I'm hitting you with a 4-4. Four, four. Hmm. Or should I have done Foundry Street Genizen anyway? Fuck it, I could do them both next turn. Yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, I mean, I guess him hitting the Menace creature tells me that he doesn't have a lot of creatures? Maybe? Or he just feared it more? I, I guess? I'm not sure. I don't know. The Mage Ring Bully will do more damage to him overall. Unless he has, like, a single blocker. Uh, does that... I think he can pop my Mage Ring right now. I would have done that after you blocked a 1-1. That was super premature. Then you would have prevented one extra damage. So, I'm gonna call that a fail. <laughs> I'm gonna just go ahead and call that a fail. He's tapped out, so I might as well just dump everything. I'm going to hold on to the Molten Vortex. I was thinking about playing it, but no. Not like this. Not like this. Not if I only have one card in my hand. I want him to think that I at least have some kind of removal or something scary for him. 
that you have to deal with. Hmm. I have not done enough damage to him yet. He's only at 13. I need to, like, really, really smack him up. Man, he's got a lot of these slow lands. He does have a play, though. He has plays. It's stuck on his uh, first and main, first and second main phase. So he's probably got removal, if I had to guess. So I'm just going to swing in, make him use it. Celestial Flare, that'll do it. Oh, I sacrifice a creature? Oh, yeah, that's... <laughs> That's not the best removal. <laughs> I could have put down the glory chaser. Actually, maybe I should have. That would have been an extra damage. That was a bad. That was a bad play. Um, he doesn't have enough to put down a creature and then board wipe. I don't think. So I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna play it a little more risky. Just a little bit, just for that little payoff. But I think I'm going to hold off on the creatures. Once I get, uh, uh, like, four creatures on the board, I start getting really scared. Hmm. Okay. That's a, that's a, that's a beast. That's a beastie boy. Yeah, I'm going to hold off on all that. Um. Or will I? Four, five. I can take out half his life. Because he's going to block the 1-1 one, one glory chaser. Yeah, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I don't think he's going to block the 2-1. I think he's going to block the 1-1 Menacer, or the potential Menacer. Because that one can cause more problems for him later down. Yeah, yeah. So this way I get an extra point down. Take him down to 5. Which puts him more in range to a bunch of uh, shit that he doesn't want to have to deal with. Uh, next turn, he'll probably... I mean, if the board stays similar, he'll probably block my uh, Street Denizen. And then I'll hit him for... One, two, three, four. And then he's pretty much dead next turn, unless I pick up, like... I just need a Twin Bolt. I need a, a Mountain. Infectious Bloodlust. What? Oh. <laughs> All right, nice. Oh, wow. I like that. <laughs> I was like, are you giving up? <laughs> no, no, I hear you, man. Oof. What a brutal play. <laughs> I love it. I love it. All right. That was good. I mean, that's a desperate as fuck play. <laughs> but uh, it works for me. Oh, for him, for him. It works for him, and I, and I like it. <laughs> that was great. Holy crap. Okay, so I can get him down to one here. <laughs> man. All right, I'm still swinging in. I'm still doing it. Whoo! <laughs> Buffing my guy to get him into what was it? Reprisal range, and then uh, <laughs> and then getting a, another uh, aura back in that process. That that was fucking perfect. That was fucking perfect. Uh, you did just, you're still, you still lost, but honestly, great plays, man. Super great. And you did smack me for five, so, grats to you, buddy. Grats to you. <laughs> oh, man. That's game. Because you can't stop that one, one. Can't stop him. That's all I need. That's fine. Oh, good game, man. Good game. Yoshi87. Well done. Seriously. I really I really like that one. That was a great one. Man, uh, was that game three? I don't remember. I'm going to do one more. Just, I don't know, because I feel like it. <laughs> they go by fast. They go by fast. We can do one more, right? You stick around for that? You don't have to. You can just skip ahead or just leave the video entirely. It's whatever. Do whatever you want, man. This is the internet. You're free. I feel like that was game three, but I'm not sure. I'll, I'll find out later. Uh, I need like a counter or something. 
I need to know. I need to know how long it takes me to play these games. Usually it takes me like 10 minutes, but with this deck, it usually takes me like six ish. I missed that name. It was like Big Root something. What was that? Oh, I'm not. Whatever, I'll get it later. Uh, this is more of a late game. I do start. Okay, I'll I'll, I'll play it. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Big Roo 808. 08. Are you 10 years old, bro? Are you less than 10 years old? <laughs> How old are you? 08. Whatever. I guess if you were born in 08, you'd be exactly 8, wouldn't you? That's that's crazy to me. Holy shit. You'd be 8 years old and born in 2008. Is that right? Yeah, it is. Cool. 2008 and you're 8. You're 8 at 2008. Wow, I'm, I'm going to be stuck up on this for a minute. Huh. Holy cow. Ooh, no plays. Good. For me, not him. Very, very bad for him. Very, very bad for him. Uh, damn it. Ah, damn it. I, I misplayed. Misplay. Should have dragon foddered there. Oh, well. I'll, I'll, go, I'll ember holler there instead, just to, uh... Uh... Okay. Okay, I guess. Then I'll have ember holler plus, uh... No, no, no. Then I'll have dragon fodder plus... Plus the, uh, fiery volt vortex or whatever it's called on, uh, next turn. All right, let's hope I'm not beating up an eight-year-old. That would make me feel kind of bad. <laughs> but uh, we'll, we'll see what I'm what I'm beating up, won't we? Maybe he just got married in, in 2008. Or maybe he... Ooh. Now? You doing that now? Hmm. Okay. I mean, if that's his only creature, then that's his only creature. You know, it's not... I can't, like, hate, hate him on that. Hate, hate on him for that. A couple fiery impulses. I'll make short work of that Nissa, though. Sorry, Nissa. You're never gonna planeswalk, baby. And I'm gonna smack you for six, which is no fun for your face. Mm mm. Ouch. Molten Vortex. Yeah, it changed my plays up, but. Whatever. Uh, I got I got a bunch of removal. Molten Vortex plus Fiery Impulse means I'm probably pretty good. I'm probably alright for a while. Uh, definitely not worried about that. That's not doing anything. Uh, are you just dead anyway? No, you're not. You're not. But you're very low. Very low health. Actually, are you dead? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yes, you are dead. Yes, you are dead. Very much. Huh. Mis misread that. Ooh, damn it. Could I have evened him out? Shit, I think I just missed my chance. God damn it. Should have held back a goblin. Yep. Fucked up. Oh well. Oh well. Good game, Big Roo08. Um, try to get more creatures. <laughs> That's all I can say for you. Uh, I think more creatures uh, against a deck like this. Unless your deck... I mean, because green-black has a lot of control, you know? So I'm a little surprised it didn't uh, it didn't, it didn't didn't fare so well against me. Um, I think I'm all set for this episode. Let's just take a quick peek at myself here. Um, rank 28. So I'm getting there. I'm, <laughs> I can't believe I, I finished Origins at rank 31. That that will haunt me forever, man. Okay. That's it for the, this episode, guys. Uh, love you, and I will see you next time. Thank you.